become a regional health care hub in the near future. President and CEO of EMED Global Jamaica Limited, Dwayne Boyce, says his company has been getting requests from other Caribbean countries such as St. Lucia and the Turks and Caicos Islands to have patients airlifted to Jamaica for treatment. This as some cannot afford treatment in the United States. There's competent physicians in Jamaica and quality services and those services can be rendered to people throughout the Caribbean region at a fraction of the price and now we actually can make the connection with these aircraft and the medical equipment. He was speaking this week at a presentation of the company's new aircraft interior which was renovated to the tune of 150,000 US dollars. EMEN has also added a new aircraft which will take passengers from one section of the island to the other. We did what most companies would not dare to do, is stay on the ground and listen. And we did that with our technology. We now have the ability from ground, from call to ground ambulance to air ambulance service to get the patient in and out in a very quick and timely manner, and that's going to save lives. That's going to change the way that healthcare is done here. EMED is the island's only air ambulance company and has been operating in Jamaica since 2010. By early next year, the government should